Well, all right. Hello, 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 hello. That's right. Santa Julia Reserva Chardonnay. Little fun time in the summer. I don't remember where I got this inexpensive white. Actually, I do. It was in a three pack, a seasonal three pack for the holiday season. And this was the white left over for summer. And since I'm on the patio and outside, we want to use a plastic glass. Sean, you shouldn't use a plastic glass for wine. Unless you do. Because, you know, hey, it's the summertime. We call these porch pounders or patio pounders, if you will. It depends. Some people have discrepancies just like tomato or tomato. Now, for this wine, it's averaging about 3.4, 3.5 stars. But what does that mean? Well, let me tell you. After drinking Chardonnay earlier today, this is a fine Chardonnay. It's happy, it's hot, it got humid today. So if you're looking at temperatures in the 80 plus degree range, this is gonna be fine for all your barbecue, chilling and grilling type of foods. Think of burgers to chicken or salads or any fun thing that you want, including fish tacos, any grill centric thing, any summer centric thing that you can think of, this wine, Santa Julia, is going to be just fine. And that goes true for most Chardonnays. Now, what's the rating going to be on this one? I'm not going to say here, but I will say on Sean J. Brady on Vivino.com. Or, actually, it's just Vivino. So, there you go. Check it out for that and all my reviews for not just for wine, but the regular wine guy, food pairings, and lots of fun with wine. Thanks for watching. We may not see you in person, but we'll always see you right here on social media. Thanks for watching.